Every day, millions of people consume products that contain zero-calorie artificial sweeteners. The idea to get a sweet tooth fix while avoiding the weight gain. The use of artificial sweeteners has exploded in recent decades, but is that a good thing? A new study done in both mice and people suggests that those artificial sweeteners may be causing physical changes in the body, such as increasing glucose intolerance, which can be a risk factor for diabetes. We have found that uh, consumption of uh, several uh, commonly used artificial sweeteners uh, was um, associated with a uh, um, susceptibility to glucose intolerance, which is a disturbance in blood glucose level uh, uh, considered to be the early sign ultimately leading to uh, diabetes. The new research published in the journal Nature is striking because it makes an unusual connection. It shows that the consumption of artificial sweeteners can cause a big change in the composition of the different colonies of bacteria that live in the gut. And that can trigger other physical effects, such as raising blood sugar levels. I think that uh, the scope of our discoveries uh, calls for a uh, public reassessment of the massive and unsupervised uh, use of artificial sweeteners um, in, in so many aspects of our nutrition. Everybody's gut carries different bacteria, meaning we all respond differently to all kinds of food. Scientists now need to identify specific bacteria populations that allow some of us to better tolerate high blood sugar levels or to keep the weight off. If they can do that, it may offer a new route for fighting obesity, diabetes and related illnesses.